All right, everybody, this is Mr. Cooper. Uh, my wife named him, not me. So I just want to show you his eye. You see how his eyes all swelled up? You see his beak? He's got a respiratory infection, and that's what we're going to be treating. So the way we're going to be doing that is with this Vet RX. bought it at Tractor Supply. It's a non-antibiotic and it's used for treating respiratory problems in chickens. So let's treat Mr. Cooper and uh, get him on the road recovery. So as you can see, I have this sitting in hot water. And what I'm gonna do, uh, because he's gonna be hard to hold and do it at the same time, You'll see some people take it and put it on their fingers. Well, that's hard for me to do. So what I like to do is just take a flat surface and just put a couple drops on the surface and then I can take my finger and rub in it and let me show you what I'm talking about. So I added me some drops on the table like I showed you. I'm gonna take his comb and I'm just gonna rub his comb with it. And it seems to really like it. I just remember this to kind of make it a little more oily. It, is you need to put it in some warm water and warm it up. Then I won't take it and I won't rub it on his beak. As he starts trying to open his mouth up, I'm going to... As he starts trying to open his mouth up, I'm actually going to try to put some in his mouth. Just like that. The main thing is I do not want to rub this on his, his eyes. I'm going to rub his comb. I rubbed his comb, but now I'm going to rub his waddle. Kind of rub the top of his head a little bit. And then because chickens like to get up under their wings, I'm going to get some and I'm just going to rub it up under the wings, just like so. All right, let me turn him over where I can get the other wing. All right. So I'm gonna go put him back and let him try to heal up. And I'll let you fire along and see how this works. I'm gonna be, it's morning time right now, so we're gonna treat him in the morning and then again in the afternoon. And we'll do this every day. And I hope by the, by the end of the week, he's healed up. So I'll just let you know how it goes. Hey, this is baby. This is uh, Mr. Cooper's best friend. She stays with him all the time. And she doesn't have any of the eye swelling like what we're talking about. But I want you to listen to her. If I can get her to. You hear her? So she's got the respiratory infection going on too. So. So what I'll do is I'm just going to go ahead and treat her the same way. Put a, her crown's not quite as big. We'll still put some on it. Get it here on her beak. And she opens her mouth up. I'll try to get this a little bit on her tongue. Get some down here on her waddle what little bit of waddle she has. She don't have a whole lot. Something back here on the back of her head and let's go ahead and get it up under her wings here. Yeah, so while it's not uh, affecting her sinuses, it's definitely affecting 
still affecting her breathing, I'm sure, because you can hear. All right, I'm just gonna go and check on the other birds and see how they're doing. Here we are five days later, and I just wanted to give you an update on Mr. Cooper. Let me bring you in closer and let you look at his eye. See how much better it looks? He's doing wonderful. Let me turn him around where you can see the other eye in comparison. So it seems that that vet RX is just working wonderfully. He even sounds good. He's not gurgling anymore. Uh, the other one we gotta check on his baby and see how she's doing. But I have to say that I'm and I'm very happy in how Vet RX worked out on his respiratory inspection or infection. I don't know what a respiratory inspection is, but but uh let's see if I can get him to be still for just a minute. <laughs> bring in real I think it's just done a wonderful job let me go get baby and let's see how she sounds well here's old baby um see if I can get her making a little bit of a little bit of noise there we go see how clear she sounds now let me kind of move her around just a little bit She's not real talkative right now. She's not a real vocal bird. So, but. <laughs> she's, but you can still hear her. She's not, she sounds so much better. There she goes. She's talking just a little bit now. And this is five days later so I couldn't be happier I hadn't have to they have to give me any antibiotics or or anything and they're doing just wonderful so I still got some antibiotic free birds <laughs> all right as always I love you God loves you and I hope you have a wonderful day